What's up? I'm Gustin. Welcome to Don't Disappoint Your Parents. My sister is going back to New York this week, and today we're celebrating my freedom from her because she's annoying and sucks. Let's get cooking. Today we're making Nobu's famous miso cod, which is actually surprisingly easy to make at home and is excellent for meal prep if you want to make your food a few days ahead. Obviously today's recipe is adapted from Chef Nobu. We're going to start by making some miso marinade. In a pan we're going to add a third of a cup of mirin, a Japanese cooking wine, and a third of a cup of sake. Bring the alcohol to a boil and let it burn off for 20 seconds. Once the alcohol evaporates, we're going to turn the heat down to low and add a third of a cup of miso paste. Stir until the miso is completely dissolved. Turn the heat back up to high and add 3 tablespoons of sugar. Mix until the sugar dissolves and the miso mixture gets a glossy shine. Take the mixture off the heat and let it cool completely. Meanwhile, we're going to cut up some black cod into manageable fillets. I have two big pieces here, so I'm just going to cut them both in half. If you can't find black cod, you could use salmon here as well. Once the miso marinade has cooled completely, we're going to add a bit of it into the bottom of a storage container. Add two of your fillets in and coat it with some of the marinade. Add the other two pieces in and coat again. Make sure everything is coated nice and evenly, otherwise the fish won't brown properly. Seal the container up and we're going to let it sit in the fridge for 2-3 to three days. You can take it out after 4 hours if you're making it day of, but it definitely won't be as good. After 2 days, take out your fish and use a paper towel to wipe off any excess marinade. Do not rinse your fish under water, just pat off the marinade and lay the fish skin set up onto a foil lined baking sheet. Add your fish in on the top rack and broil for 3 minutes. If you don't have a broiler, set the oven to as high as it can go. Meanwhile, we're going to make some vegetables because we got to be healthy. I'm going to make some sauteed pea shoots, which is a very common Chinese vegetable, but spinach works too. In a hot pan with oil, add 2 cloves of minced garlic. Saute for a bit before adding in your pea shoots and a bit of salt. Add about half a cup of water and cover the pan. Let the pea shoots cook for 2 minutes before uncovering, stirring a bit, and taking it off the heat. Once the 3 minutes for the fish is done, take it out and flip it. Make sure you use utensils when you're flipping the fish, otherwise you will burn yourself. Put the fish back into the oven for another 3 minutes. Once those 3 minutes are done, move the fish to the middle rack and let it cook for another 2 minutes. Take the fish out once it is flaky, tender, and beautifully charred. I'm trying to be a little fancier with my plating so we're springing for a nice plate today. Start by placing your fish in the center of the plate. Struggle a little on deciding where to put the pea shoots, then commit to a parallel pattern. Garnish with a bit of lemon zest to counter the richness of the fish and a few slices of ginger. And there you have a beautiful miso cod. The fish is rich and buttery. The pea shoots are delicately tender with just a touch of lemon to brighten things up a bit. For her last show for a while, please welcome Jamie Chen. Jamie, we have your miso black cod, my miso black cod in front of you for you. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, is this, are we at home or is this Nobu? Oh, yes, exactly. It like looks Nobu. amazing. Um, color is excellent. It smells great. Ooh, very flaky. Mmm. Looks really good. <laughs> you get the miso flavor. Cod is perfectly cooked. Nice and fatty. I get the little bit of like the ginger, lemon, mm -hmm. zest taste. The dough mao is good. It's quite good. Nice. I'm very impressed. Thank you. This is one of my favorite foods, so I think you know you're on your way. I would pay forty dollars for this. Nice. There we go. <laughs> That's what we like to hear. <laughs> um. Yeah. Well. I'm gonna miss your food a lot. I'm gonna miss you so much, Jamie. Oh, oh wait, what, mom? Oh, my flight's canceled? Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, no, no, I'm here. I'm here forever. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm getting so annoying. Bye-bye. <laughs>